Magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat. Ako po ay nagagalak sa pagkakataon ito, pagkakataon ito na magbahagi ng salita ng Diyos ang magandang. So, malapit na po ang Pasko and Merry Christmas sa inyong lahat. Uh, maybe some of us are expecting for a gift. Of course, of course kasi parang yun yung naging essence ng Christmas to. It is all about giving. It is all about giving. Or maybe some of us, tayo na talaga yung nagbibigay ng regalo. But this time, I want to share this kind of gift. Gusto niyo yun? The gift na free sa bawat isa sa. Let's go to the book of John. Chapter 3, verse 16. I will just share this one verse. Gusto ko mag-focus tayo dito. Sabi John, For God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son, that whoever believes in Him shall not perish, but have eternal life. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, thank you so much, Lord, sa magandang umaga, sa magandang buhay. Salamat, Panginoon, sa pagkakataon ito na ibahagi ang iyong salita. Lord, naway sa mga makikinig, Panginoon, bigyan mo sila ng understanding, bigyan mo sila ng knowledge. Even I, Panginoon, itago mo ako sa iyong likuran and let your light shine, Panginoon. Ikaw yung mag-glow, ikaw yung, ikaw yung maranasan ng bawat isa sa umaga nito. We just want to entrust you everything in Jesus' name. Amen. For God so loved the world that He gave His, His one and only Son. And that is the love of Jesus. Dahil sa pagmamahal ng Panginoon sa atin, He gave His one and only Son. And this is my question to you. If you will be a father, of course, to His Son, do you, will you allow your Son na ilagay sa isang posisyon na alam mong masasaktan siya, ilagay sa isang posisyon na alam mong mahihirapan siya, Papayag ka ba as a father? Of course, your answer, answer will be no. Kasi hindi, alam natin masasaktan siya. And we are very concerned about the feelings, di ba? Hindi natin papayagan na masaktan yung mga sarili nating anak. But this kind of love na, na, na patuloy natin nararanasan, even tinatalikuran na, siya, na natin siya minsan, pero, what kind of love this is, it is? But for God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son. And who is that Son? It is Jesus. Pero, do you see yung mga ginawa ng Panginoon? Do you see how much He loved the world? Even this kind of world is napapalibutan ng mga evil, evil deeds. Alam mo yun? Pero yung pagmamahal ng Panginoon na, na hindi kumukupas. He, he sent His Son, Jesus, who died on the cross to save us from our sins. That whoever believes in Him shall not perish but have an eternal or everlasting life. For those who believe in Him. And that the greatest gift that we have is the salvation na meron tayo, is the eternal life na meron tayo. That is the comfort of God. Pero how much we give importance sa verse na ito. Ito yung famous verse in the Bible. For God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son. But how we value the love of God sa atin. Binigay niya yung sarili niyang anak to save the sinner's world. But tayo, we always desire to do the evil things. Sabi nga dito sa John 3 verse 9, This is the verdict, light has come into the world, but people love darkness instead of light. Because their deeds were evil. Mas ginugusto ng mga tao or mas most or some of 
the people love darkness mas ginugusto nila yung mga bagay na pansamantalang pansamantala de mas gusto nila na mahalin yung mga bagay na pansamantala mga saya na pansamantala why not we desire for an overflowing joy why not we desire for the love na hindi nag-fulfill for the love na hindi kumukupas and God is offering His life sa atin but we people uh, sorry sa term na makakapal yung muka pero wala akong uh, maybe that the, the kind uh, the, the, the one term na pwede kong masabi I'm sorry for that word makakapal ang muka na si Lord na yung nag-offer ng anak niya eh pero ano yung ginagawa natin tinatalikuran hindi natin pinapansin yung salvation na mayroon tayo because we love to do the things na alam natin hindi naman talaga magtatagal we love to do the things na alam natin pansamantala lang naman natin mararamdaman yung saya maybe some of you will say that's human I, I'm just a human I'm just I'm not perfect This is not about the perfection. Perfection. This is not about how you, how perfect you are, because God is the only perfect God. We are just human. We 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 don't need to be perfect, but we need to be a better for person for the Lord. We need to desire more to God. We need to value the love of Jesus into our life. It is not very easy for a father to send his son into the world para lang saktan ng mga tao. It is not an easy way. Pero because we are so much loved by God, and that is his attribute, he is a loving father, his love is unfailing. But how we give back? Paano natin binabalik? Paano natin sinusuklian? yung pagmamahal na ibinibigay ng Panginoon, Panginoon sa atin. Let us embrace the love of God into our life. Let us practice the salvation, this kind of gift from God. This gift na pang long last, this gift na pang eternal, this gift na hindi lang magsasattle for less. Ito yung regalo na free from God. Why not let us desire for it? Why not let us practice our faith? Why not let us desire to know more God? Why not let us desire to, 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 to learn from His Word in the Bible? Because the Word of God is alive and active. And I do believe that if we desire more to know God, we are never to be content anymore. We will seal the true love. We will feel the overflowing joy sa ating mga puso. And I praise God for His awesome and surpassing greatness sa ating mga puso. Let us remember this verse in John 3.16 that for God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son that whoever believes in Him shall not perish but have eternal life let us decide to know Jesus and let us always learn and pray and pray to Jesus let us always give back to love Jesus let us pray. Heavenly Father, we are so much thankful and grateful, Panginoon. 
sa pagmamahal mo sa amin. Though sometimes, Panginoon, we feel that we are condemned, but you say to your word that we are not condemned anymore because you save us, Panginoon, because we receive you, Panginoon. But Lord, this word, Panginoon, in John 3.16, na magkamaroon ito ng essence, Panginoon. Mas maintindihan namin, Panginoon. Mas magbigay ito ng, ng karunungan sa amin, Lord. And how we, we, we will give back the love, Panginoon, na isinishare mo sa amin. At patuloy mong ibinibigay, Lord. Be, even we are unworthy, Panginoon. Truly, your love is unfailing, Lord. Kahit minsan napapabayaan namin mag-devotion, minsan hindi na hindi hindi kami naniniwala minsan our faith are shaken but Lord truly you stand Panginoon truly your promises are true Panginoon truly you are the God na sumasagot talaga ng panalangin Panginoon you are the God of impossible you are amazing God Lord give us comfort and give us peace sa buong araw na ito Panginoon for the strength and wisdom in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit Amen Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong panunod and God bless everyone